Hi, welcome to this SSRS tutorial video and today we're going to look at adding totals to reports and also adding groups to reports. This video was recorded in April 2021 using Visual Studio 2012. So on screen um, I've got a pretty basic report if I just preview it. You can see I've got uh, first name, last name, job title and city and I've got a country and a sales column. What I want to do is I want to add a, a, a total to the bottom of there so it shows me the total of all of those sales. Go back to design. Um, I can, at the bottom here, there's a, there's a, a details section. There's a few different ways of doing this. Um, the easiest way for me anyway is click on the drop down, click on add total, click on after, and it'll add a total. What I'm going to do is I'm just going to highlight that cell, make it bold, um, change the color to be black as opposed to doing grey and now if we preview that we should see at the bottom a total nice i'm going to go back here i'm going to highlight all of those if i right click now i've got an option to merge to make that all one cell and i can type in here report total um make that bold make it black and it's odd thing right now I've got the option of changing these things here but as soon as I go into here and start messing about um, and I come back to here the options oh, in fact they have appeared but sometimes they don't appear and you've got to click out and click back in anyway there it is I can right justify that now if I preview my report um, I've got a nice little report total so now let's think about adding a group so what I want to see is all the US um, sales together and the, the Canada's together and the Australia's together or the one Australia up in the one United Kingdom but let's group them by countries. Let's go back to design. Um, we'll click on this drop down again and we've got an add group option here. Let's add a parent group and in this drop down it shows us all of the fields that are available on our report. Sure enough, I've only got six here, but there are a lot more available in our data set. So what I'm interested in is grouping by the country. So I'm going to click OK to that. And it's created me a group on the left hand side here. Um, so what I want to do is I'm going to get rid of my column, my country code column here, because it's going to now be on the left hand side. Uh, if I preview that you'll now see that we've got Australia at the top, Canada with two, France, Germany, UK with only one each, and then in the United States. So now I want to add totals for each of these groups. Let's go back to design. Now, um, because of the way we did this, initially we only had one group, so we clicked on the details and we said give us a total, and it gave us a full report total. Now that we've got a, a parent group, we're interested in adding a total to the details. So if I go to details and I say add total and I say after, you'll see it's added a total within this country region kind of block outside of the of the whole report here. So in order to kind of show that, if I change the colour to be burgundy and um, see he hasn't offered that. Um, I go back to it bold and we may make it underlined just so that we'll see what it is and I want to go across here I'm going to merge these add um, country total and right justify make that burgundy bold now if I preview my report, there we've got the country totals. So the last thing to do, I mean it's no good just seeing country total, that doesn't really help. So let us um, come into here and we will go to expression. And so instead of it saying country total, let's say equals 
uh, we've got a field in here which is our country region name and we can concatenate it with a little plus and say and I'm hoping that that should now give us the correct there you go Australia total, United Kingdom total, Canada total, we need two and US total that's the end of that of this tutorial um if you liked it please give me a thumbs up any comments is appreciated uh, it helps me with my content um i hope you found this video helpful thanks very much for watching